Hi, we're in the woods and today we're going to cook some tandoor chicken. I'm going to cook it here and then I'll take it home and use it for my dinner tonight. So it's about 7 in the morning and I'm doing this before I have to go to work. So we'll see how it goes on. If it goes on at all. So, once this lot burns down, I should have a good amount of coals in it and I can start barbecuing. So, just it's a matter of waiting now. The, the wood, you can hear the wood sizzling a bit, it's, it's not completely dry. Uh, it's been lying out here in the woods for months and it's been getting rained on. And it's been actually been lying in there on the floor so it's not as dry as I'd like it but it's working so we'll see like it as we start cooking so the fire's gone pretty well now uh, just need to wait, let, let it burn down a bit uh, well a good bit and then I'll get the chicken going and we'll see what that looks like a woman just passed me with a dog there must have been wondering what it was up to. Anyway, let the fire burn down. So I've got a chicken going. Uh, I've not got a lot of time, so I need to just crack on. Flames only died down properly, but I've got work to go to soon, so I need to get this done. So it's looking good, it smells fantastic, and and I'll finish the chicken off later on when I'm making my my meal. So that's about that then. So that's the chicken, it's half cooked and I'll finish it off later on uh, when I'm making my my dish tonight. So I don't want it to be too too cooked or it'll dry it'll be too dry when I when I, I heat it up again so it's just about right so I'll see when I'm making the dish so after you're finished with your barbecue try and leave no trace uh, be as inconspicuous as you possibly can tell your litter with you and bon appetit